Grotto of Heavy Metal Television, and I'm here at Joe's Grotto in Phoenix, Arizona, and I'm with some of the dudes from Incantation. So, oh, yeah. why don't we start out with you dudes introducing yourselves for our watchers or viewers out there who may not know who you are. Okay, well, I'm John, vocalist, guitar player for Incantation. <laughs> As you can tell, <laughs> yeah. be talking oh. to you. <laughs> and, uh, and I'm Kyle, and I'm the drummer. I just beat on things. Sunny guitar. Nope. Right on. So you guys just came from a show in LA, correct? Yeah, that's correct. So what is this? Uh, the end of a tour that you're doing? No. Or what's going it, on? It's just a weekend thing, really. It was a one-off for the fest in LA <clears throat> for Greg Anderson's. Uh, so power we ripped. Yeah, power ripped. Ripped. Yeah, power ripped. Him, Sam, do, and uh, so we just, you know, it makes sense. We booked a couple extra shows, um, and then as after we had, you know, booked these, and then of course we got the tour offer, and we're coming right back through here in two months. Exactly. Same place as L.A. and here. With Marduk, right? Yeah. I'm gonna yeah. be at that show, man. You guys better be there. Right? Yeah, it's gonna be a good, uh, good tour, and uh, so this is. I don't want to say a warm-up show for that, but you know what I mean. It's uh, it's just an added bonus. Yeah, so, so uh, when was the last time you guys were in Arizona? I don't remember. I don't think I was there because this is this is gonna be the first time. Oh, okay. Uh, two, two years ago. Or was it a year ago? On the West Coast tour, we did a it was, Phoenix show. Um, yeah, that January 2015. Okay. Was, um, yeah. Where was it at? I forget. Uh, it was in uh, Mesa and it was at the uh, Aztec. So, yeah, that was uh, that was cool. That was real cool. And actually, we have a, uh, a live video out right now for Carrie and Prophecy. And uh, that's the footage we used. Or at least 90% of the footage is used from that show, actually. You gotta take a close look at that. I'm sure you guys will recognize the stage. Note. So, Make a note, man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it just, we filmed every show on that tour, and that one was just badass. And All <coughs> you guys have a new album coming out in 2017, I heard. Yeah. So tell me, uh, what's the muse? What's the inspiration for that new album? What, what, where did you get it? We bought it. <laughs> We're getting old. It's a lot easier just to have some contact, young kids write it. And we just flip them a few beers and we just steal it. <laughs> it's just much easier that way. Like, the truth's got to be told. <laughs> yeah. so, like, yeah. And I thought you guys are artists here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It says that on my laminate somewhere. You got a Van Allen shirt that makes me an artist. <laughs> no, it's got to yeah. be a Diamond Day rules. Okay. Yeah, we're, at, we're at Dave TV right now. Did you know that? Because that's how it's going. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You're a little young for Dave TV. <laughs> oh, shit, man. I feel like... you got to research it now. We'll see. Yeah. Well, he's just a jingle. Okay. Marinating me. <laughs> Fucking sweet. <laughs> So, I uh, have to ask, because, you know, yeah, reading the lyrics right. of your song, it seems that you guys are, you know, drawing inspiration from a lot of events in history, literature, and, dude, the librarian in you just has to know. What do you guys read? It? You did some I want to know. You said you didn't do no homework. I, yeah. uh -huh. I got to know what you read. That. What are you reading? Uh, that, are you reading anything at the moment? That's our brainiac bass player, Chuck. Yeah. He's a historian. And, and just he's, he's, he's too a, smart. He's a um, information like he just absorbs information like crazy. I mean, he comes up with stuff. He has to explain me what the hell he's talking about. Right? Yeah. Read the and lyrics, and, and, like, and know how to pronounce the words. Or anything else. It gets, uh, <laughs> so for the last uh, eight years, the last couple records, the last three records for sure, uh, he's, he's wrote. Well, last one, I'd say 100%, and then prior to that, 90%, 89%, prior to that, really, majority of John, and myself, a little bit, and different members of the year, so the most recent. The recent stuff is Chuck, and Chuck is uh, kind of a brainy guy with books and stuff like that. I mean, the guy has an awesome knowledge of history. And stuff that I, you know, like I didn't know about or whatever. You no, know, it brings up very great. Yeah, it's, really, um, it's pretty cool. Yeah, it's really cool because he's, he doesn't just come up with, um, you know, simple, basic, um, 
death metal type lyrics comes up with something that is more um, interesting, you know, for you to read into it. And, and if, you, if you understand what the other lyrics are about, you find that it's, you know, something with some kind of crazy um, pagan history or there's some stuff that was like um, part of old Greek uh, mythology and, um, you know, just old, like, and it's usually, you know, all still based around organized religion, you know, everything that, you know, has been anti, anti all these years. Some sort of, um, some sort of, like, religion or ideology or something like that, it's usually based around yeah. these lyrics, yeah. Yeah. Like, you guys are Anyways, I mean, I think we cut you off, but yeah, we do have a new record coming out, coming out this year. Um, Later on in the year, and I'm sure exactly when. Next year, 2017. Yeah, not this year. I'm already in 17. So, and uh, we'll, really? we'll just have the normal uh, tour in the world for it. And um, it's on relapse, so this is our first record back with them in uh, 20 years or something. A long time. Using the same artist, right? Uh, that we have for the last. Uh, the last, album. the last album. Do you guys ever yeah. consult with him about the image of the artist, or you just say, just do whatever you want to do? One hundred percent consulting uh, with Chuck, because yeah. oh, no. the album cover, if, if you really look into it, it's it's the lyrics. Uh, majority of the songs are in that art. It's 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 the the visual image of the lyrics that Chuck writes. So Chuck, you know, speaks directly with. Um, uh, he, 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 I don't know how to say his name. <laughs> he's probably watching me all night. You love know, right. you. But it's, it's, I know how to spell it though, but I can't pronounce it. Yeah. Elaran. So Iran. Iran. Uh, it's not Iran. No. Not Iran. E I L A N. You get that? E I L A N. That's Lawrence L or E L I A N. That would be Elaine. That sounds great. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to say Elaine. But anyways, yeah, that's our artist. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure he appreciates your... Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, he does. What it is, is Chuck and him kind of work on the um, basic concept, make sure all the stuff's in there. But then the rest of us kind of look at it and make sure that it's also... Like, it's something we like too, like visually interesting. Look at it, sometimes you add too much... Too many things in there where you start to lose it. You know, we try to keep, keep it under control where it's still good to look at, but it also represents the American uh, content. Like, they get too much. Yeah. Yeah. Cheers, 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 Arizona. Cheers. All the Cheers. internet. Well, this is the internet around the world. This yes, is probably, internet around right. the world. Is. Some people can't understand a word you're saying right now. Okay. <laughs> too bad. Love you all, Samigos. Yeah. 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 Yeah.